Hey Susan, how are you? Wow, that's a beautiful dress. Thank you, Teacher Joyce. Um, Teacher Joyce? Yes? May I ask you something, please? Sure, go right ahead. If you did something, and it's a very bad thing, what would you do? Something like what, Susie? Let's say, but it's not me, we're just saying. Okay. So you broke something, like a cup which your mother loves so much, and then you hid it under the chair, but then your mother finds it and says it's your sister who did it. Did you tell her that it was you and not your sister? Not really. I was so scared. I didn't want to get into trouble. I didn't want my mother to be angry with me. But now my sister is so upset. And if she tells my mom, I'm going to be in a lot of trouble. You know, Susie, we must always be honest. This is the right thing to do. When you do something wrong, you admit it and ask for forgiveness. Um. Even if it's difficult. But I'll be in a lot of trouble. Lies always catch up to you. The Bible tells us in the book of Proverbs, chapter 12, verse 13, that lies will get any man into trouble, but honesty is its own defense. Maybe if I had told the truth, my sister would not have got into trouble. Exactly. So what are you going to do now? The right thing. I'm going to go tell my the truth. Also, I'm going to tell my sister that I'm so, so sorry. That's the right thing to do. I'm glad that you have, you have admitted your mistakes and chosen to make things right. Would you love me to come with you? That's okay, teacher Grace. I think I can manage. And thank you for telling me this truth from Proverbs yeah. chapter 12, verse 13. Okay, yes, lies will get any man into trouble, but honesty is its own defense. All right, Chester, then. Bye. Bye.